In the 5th century BC, ancient Greece was a hive of intellectual curiosity and innovation. It was an era that saw the rise of some of the most influential minds in human history. Among them was Metton, an astronomer who left an indelible mark on the development of astronomy. Metton was born around 470 BC in Athens, Greece, a city that was rapidly becoming the epicenter of intellectual and cultural excellence. His early education was likely influenced by the teachings of Pythagoras, a renowned mathematician and philosopher who had recently settled in Athens. The young Metton was fascinated by the mysteries of the universe and spent countless hours studying the movements of celestial bodies. His most significant contribution to astronomy was his discovery of the 19-year lunar cycle, now known as the Metonic Cycle. The Metonic Calendar, also known as the Metonic Cycle, is a 19-year cycle used to reconcile the solar and lunar calendars. The solar calendar, also known as the tropical year, is based on the Earth's revolution around the Sun and is approximately 365.25 days long. The lunar calendar, on the other hand, is based on the moon's orbit around the Earth and is approximately 29.5 days long. The problem with using only a solar or lunar calendar is that they don't align perfectly. For example, if we only used a lunar calendar, the year would be about 11 days shorter than the solar year, and the months would drift through the seasons over time. On the other hand, if we only used a solar calendar, the months would not correspond to the phases of the moon. To solve this problem, Metten discovered that a cycle of 19 solar years is equivalent to 235 lunar months, with 12 years of 12 lunar months and 7 years of 13 lunar months. This means that over the course of 19 years, there will be 235 full moons, and the same seasonal dates will occur on the same days of the month. To implement the metonic calendar, intercalations, or the insertion of extra days or months, are necessary to keep the calendars in sync. In the metonic calendar, an extra month is added every two or three years, and an extra day is added every four years. This ensures that the lunar and solar calendars remain aligned. The metonic calendar was used in ancient Greece, particularly in the Athenian calendar, and was also used in other ancient cultures, such as the Babylonians and the Egyptians. The metonic cycle is still used today in some religious calendars, such as the Jewish calendar. The calendar starts with the summer solstice and consists of 12 months, with an additional 13th month, called embolimos, added seven times in the 19-year cycle. The Embolimos month is added to the end of the year and is usually around 30 days long, ensuring that the lunar and solar cycles remain aligned. This innovative calendar system is remarkably accurate, with an error of only about one day every 100 years, and was widely used in ancient Greece for many centuries. In ancient Greece, a calendar played a crucial role in society, serving as a vital tool for agricultural planning, religious festivals, commercial and economic activities, and civic and political life. Before Metton's discovery, the ancient Greeks used a lunisolar calendar, which was based on the cycles of the moon and the sun, but this calendar was not very accurate and had several limitations. The lunar year, which was the basis of the calendar, was shorter than the solar year, which meant that the calendar would drift away from the actual seasons over time, and to account for this discrepancy, the ancient Greeks would occasionally insert an extra month, called an intercalary month, into the calendar, but this process was not systematic and often led to confusion. Furthermore, the lunar and solar cycles were not synchronized, making it difficult to predict the timing of astronomical events, such as eclipses. The Prematonic calendar in use during the 5th century BCE was the Athenian calendar, which was based on a 12-month lunar year, but this calendar was not very accurate, and the Athenians would often have to add or remove days to keep the calendar in sync with the lunar cycle. 
His discovery of the 19-year lunar cycle and his development of the Metonic calendar revolutionized the way the ancient Greeks kept track of time, providing a more accurate, predictable, and easier-to-use calendar that had a significant impact on various aspects of ancient Greek society, including agriculture, religion, commerce, and civic life. There have been some unsubstantiated claims that Meton of Athens might have applied his mathematical knowledge, including the estimation of the area of a circle using polygons or played a crucial role in designing and constructing the Athenian water supply system. However, these assertions are not based on solid historical evidence and should be regarded as speculative at best. In reality, Meton is primarily known for his work in astronomy. It is essential to distinguish between historical facts and speculative theories when discussing ancient natural philosophers and their contributions. Although he was a prominent astronomer, attributing the estimation of the area of a circle using polygons or other mathematical discoveries to him without solid evidence is not accurate or supported by historical records. Meton's life and creations encapsulate the boundless power of human curiosity and ingenuity. By exploring his life and work, we deepen our appreciation for ancient Greece's intellectual achievements.